Now, while the pandemic has brought much anxiety, there are also many uplifting stories. Ordinary people going the extra mile to support each other. Let's hear from one lady in Taipei who lent a helping hand to her elderly neighbor, as well as medical workers who rustled up a cake for a little boy on his birthday. Ms. Guo reenacts the scene for us. While working at her timber company, she received a phone call from an elderly lady asking when she could get a vaccine. The older lady on the phone was quite panicky. She was asking what category was she in, when would she join the queue, was she eligible? I said I would try and find out for her and help sort it out. Ms. Guo was able to get in contact with the borough chief in the lady's neighborhood and helped resolve the questions. Everyone is very concerned about this issue. I explained we are still waiting for the Ministry of Health and Welfare to make an announcement, and then we will let everyone know how to get their vaccines. Here in Hechen Borough in Nangang District, Taipei, there are more than 1,200 residents over the age of 65, more than 25 percent of the population. The borough chief has answered many inquiries about vaccines and was grateful for Ms. Guo's help. And there was an equally heartwarming story from the quarantine center in New Taipei. An entire family of five was recently admitted to the center after a nine-year-old boy was confirmed to have COVID. To make things worse, it was his birthday. But doctors and nurses made sure to mark the day with an online party and cake. We have many whole families with COVID in the center and their mood is very heavy. So we thought maybe this is a time to give him a cake and a nice extra surprise. As the Level 3 alert continues, it's a time of frustration and anxiety for many of us. But there are lots of ways in which we can put a smile on our neighbors' faces just by showing a little bit of extra care and kindness.